Hello everybody. From the bone here. I did a short earlier this morning about Donald Trump and he lost the fraud case and uh he committed fraud on like 75, 80% of his properties, including the main one that he has through his father, Fred Trump, who was 32. That trust that he has, guess what? That's got to be dissolved. Uh, most of his properties in New York, they're going to have to be dissolved in 10 days. And <laughs> I saw yesterday that they had, they said that one of the jurors, let me show you how smart Donald Trump teams think they are and how stupid they are. The judge excused one of the jurors, but Ms. Hobble going to take her opportunity to say she thinks she has it too because she dined with her mom and dad and she hadn't felt uh, right and uh, good well ever since then. How about the next day they got a picture of her with Donald Trump? Ain't quarantined. Donald Trump right beside her. Ain't got no mask on. She don't have a mask on. So if you got COVID, I know they tell you to stay in for five days. That's usually the protocol now. So she lied. She got caught in a lie. Y'all want to know why stuff is happening the way it's happening with Donald Trump and his team? Because they lie. You can't get in court and lie. You cannot. These judges are going to rip you apart. They've already been ripping her apart because she don't know a damn thing about courting procedures. She don't know nothing about how to present evidence. She don't know how to tag evidence. She don't know how to the right questions to ask. She just, I, I mean, with her as Donald Trump's lawyer, that's just like he's getting hit with friendly fire. I'm telling y'all, it, it's, it's pitiful. She is, Donald Trump has already done sunk himself. Y'all don't misunderstand. He already done sunk himself. But you got Miss Hubble helping him. While he's sinking, she pouring water on him. And he's sitting there and look at her like, she knows what the hell she's doing. The opening day when they had to stop the proceeding three times, to try to coach her in how they do stuff in federal prison, in federal uh, court, and she still don't get it. After she done been taught by the judge, really. And after that, he snapped on her the the other two times that he had to adjourn. So, y'all want to know why Donald Trump in the predicament he's in? It's because the kind of person he is. It's because of the criminal acts he's done. And y'all have a nerd to write me and talking about Donald Trump has not done nothing wrong. Really? Wow. Well, unless they change the definition of wrong and right, you're wrong. You're the only one wrong. You and him. You're wrong for repeating what the hell he's saying. Because it makes no sense. They got evidence on this man. They got audio. They got video. They got everything they need. Everything they need. And Miss Miss Hubble is helping them. Inadvertently, because she's stupid as hell. And she tried to stand there with her designer glasses, her designer suit, her 15 minutes of fame. And I told y'all a couple of videos ago, you think they can't put uh lawyers in jail for perjury? You think they can't put lawyers in jail for contempt of court? And that's what she just done, contempt of court, because she lied, talking about she's sick and still going. Make it make sense, people. Please make it make sense. Donald Trump and some of the rest of his people, his main flunkies, they are not ready in two months. In two months' time, they are not ready. Donald Trump going to be just getting over the devastation of you almost living like a common man. When they take all your money, this, the, you had disdain for common people. You had disdain for people that's not rich. And you're going to be one of them. 
So what kind of disdain you gonna have for yourself? Cause you should be kicking yourself in the ass talking about, I was a jackass for trying to do this in this country. A country that has no history of nobody successfully being a traitor and committing fraud. But I got to give it to Donald Trump. He was able to get away with it for 77 years. Because I believe he was born dirty. Myself, he came from a dirty daddy. So the apple don't fall too far from the tree, people. And y'all talk about Trump in 2024. Yep, this going to be the year 2024 that he takes his ass to prison. That's going to be the highlight of 2024. Because he's going. He's going. Y'all honestly think he's going to beat 91 indictments? And they really don't need but one conviction. As soon as they get that one uh, conviction... All the other trials gonna be like a domino effect. He gonna fall, 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 fall. He might well not even show up for the rest of the trials. It's just a formality after that. Because do you think judge, uh, the judge that he talked about that's in charge of the DC case, do y'all honestly think Donald Trump is gonna win that? He done talked about this lady. Y'all done swatted on that lady talking about she was hurt. Police had to go storm my house and all that stuff. Why? Just be logical, people. Why put fuel on a fire? It's already a fire. It's already a four alarm fire. And you're going to throw a can with a barrel full of explosives on it? <clears throat> Donald Trump? Not smart, buddy. Not smart at all. But I tell y'all this. Keep watching. Keep watching the news. Keep looking. Y'all mugger people, y'all gonna watch Donald Trump in the rally. That's all y'all gonna watch. Because he got y'all brainwashed to say all the other news is fake news. Which, really and truly, <clears throat> the only fake news is his. The only people ain't really living in reality is y'all mugger people. Everybody else got reality. Donald Trump is a filthy ass man. And he's going to go to a filthy-ass place, which is prison. And I'm going to tell y'all like this. <clears throat> if they do not, and I'm going to tell you, they'll do that for the hell of it. Y'all don't know how vindictive the U.S. can be now. Ask some of them traitors. Dictators. Ask all them folks. Go out there and ask them folks that's committed, uh, what's his name, Ramsey Rousseff. Ask all them. How it's going to work out for you. He's at AD Explorers. And Donald Trump going to be somewhere similar. He think he's going to go to a Kush prison. And he's going to have unlimited cable TV. He's going to be able to do this. He's going to be able to order in. He's going to be able to order in no way because he ain't going to have no money. But just say if he had money. When he goes to prison. Which he ain't going to have much of once he get there. Do y'all understand that unless people take Donald Trump some stuff or put money on his books, Donald Trump going to be eating food that's one year out of date or more. And on the box, it tell you from the start, not for human consumption. That could be horse meat, buzzard meat. All, that could be anything. They're already telling you it ain't for human consumption. And neither is dog food. It ain't for human consumption. But they sell it. And some folks have been known to eat it. But Donald Trump, if you don't have no money, you'll think uh, dog food is filet mignon. Where are you going? Because I hear those meals are awful. Well, I know it can't, it can't be nothing but awful if it's out of date. And it already ain't for human consumption. You already giving me some bad stuff. And it's already out of date too. Now. That could be pigeon you eating. Pigeon on a stick. Anything. I'm telling y'all. They treat those prisoners like they ain't even human. Donald Trump ain't used to that. <clears throat> Donald Trump. I'm telling y'all. When he get convicted. 
It would not be three months where Donald Trump done lost his mind. He already done lost it. I'm talking about finish losing it. He, he gonna really flip out. Once he hit that door cell, that, that cell door, clink. Realization, it, it sets in then, people. When that door shut behind you, everything sits in. He got the little bit of cell. All the thing he can look at is the wall, the toilet, and the little bunk that he's gonna be uh, sitting on, in there crying on, asking Jesus uh, to forgive him for not for believing in him. Because you, you, you got to be mad to do some of the stuff Donald Trump done tried. Look at the stuff he tried, y'all. Look how he tried it. He tried to be smart doing it. And he knew that he had a lot of corrupt people that will follow him. Mark Meadows and, and Eula Giuliani. All that. He knew he had flunkies. Come in, always keep flunkies. Always. So, the thing I want to <clears throat> say is I told y'all I know this country I know it well I serve this country and I know certain ways you don't mess up in the United States certain ways you don't mess up I'm telling you and this is one of well two of them because he tried to be a dictator and a traitor two things that America just cannot stand so the only thing I'm can say about that is Donald Trump overestimated his ability and underestimated the United States. That's all in a nutshell. He overestimated his power and underestimated the United States power. But he getting ready to see real fast that they getting ready to flip the script on him. He getting ready to see that fast. I say by May or June, when it ain't going Donald Trump's way, and the inevitable is getting ready to happen, he's going to be convicted. I want to know how many people going to write me, because I get a lot of Donald Trump supporters coming on everything that I post, which is fine. Like I said, I open this for a debate. I, I, I'm not going to shy away from y'all comments and all that stuff. I'm going to be professional, though. I'm not going to, y'all not going to get me into getting out of my character. You, you did the other day. I'll give y'all that. You did the other day because I was angry because they're talking about my family and all that stuff. You notice the people's own family is on trial is the Trumps. Not my family. So we ain't even got to discuss my family. Because my family would never do nothing like this. Period. Nobody in my family would be a traitor. Nobody in my family would try to be a dictator. Period. So my family ain't got nothing to do with it. My family didn't start this debate I did. <clears throat> I started it to be a clean debate. If y'all got y'all points, like I told you, if y'all got valid points on why y'all think Donald Trump won't be convicted, and it's got to be something better than he didn't do nothing wrong. It sounded stupid when he said it. So it sounded worse when y'all say it and repeat it. Have your own brain. Please. And like I said on those videos, that swatting y'all doing, Y'all gonna probably be in jail before him. If you keep keep doing that. Keep doing it. I'm telling you. I'm telling y'all. This is serious. It's not fake. It's not no witch hunt. <clears throat> it's not no conspiracy theory. It's none of that. It's facts, people. Y'all need to start looking at the news and stop listening to what Donald Trump's saying. And y'all need to start looking at the news and how everything going out ha happening in court. Don't be waiting for him to come out there and feel y'all full of lies when he get out of court. And in court, he don't say nothing. He can't say nothing because the judge and told him to sit down and shut up. Or he'll remove him. It's going to be a whole different ball game now for the criminal trials. He won't be able to do none of that. 
outbursts and stuff like that. Miss Hobble, they catch you in a lie like you just got caught in. You'll be going to jail. I'm telling you, you might face some stuff now. So you might want to be careful. Remember I told y'all I was at the playground with my granddaughter. And I told y'all, you think a lawyer can't go to jail? Y'all going to find out. Because I know Miss L Ms. Hobble going to lie because she a female Donald Trump. That's all she is. That's why she's sticking around. But anyway, like I said, I'm going to go back in here and look at some more because now it's intriguing because it's happening just the way it's supposed to happen, just the way I told y'all it was going to happen. I didn't mix no words. I didn't sugarcoat nothing. I told y'all he has messed up really bad this time, and it ain't no reversing it. I ain't no reversing it. And them appeals, you might as well forget it, buddy. You think them appeals going to delay your October trial? You already set for one in March. This one going to conclude in uh, October. The disassembling of your money and your assets and tearing your businesses down, that's going to be on your mind when you get in the courtroom because you're going to be almost broke, if not broke. So, like I said, I like waking up to good news. Good news for us, bad news for y'all. But somebody got to win and somebody got to lose. And the odds are in our favor. We're, our people, our client is not looking at 91 indictments. The non-Trump supporters, we have brains. We can't be fed a lot of B BS. So don't get mad at us because we're a little bit harder to fool than y'all. So now y'all mad at us. Like I said, you think they had these trials for nothing? You think they got them indictments for nothing? You can't indict nobody if you ain't seen it or you got proof. In court, you got to have facts and proof. Donald Trump ain't got no facts and truth on nothing he's saying on social media at all. None. That's why they losing miserably because they ain't got no defense. None. At all. Talking about the 14th Amendment. Or no, talking about the First Amendment. That's your defense? They ought to just go and skip your trials and go and put you away now. Because if you think just because you got the First Amendment that absolves you from everything you've done wrong, you finna be taught a lesson, Donald Trump. You been, you getting ready to be taught a whole bunch of lessons that you should have been taught years ago because your daddy should have beat your ass a long time ago when you was a little boy. Because I know you had them same traits that you got now. You don't decide one day that you're going to be evil and corrupt all in one day. That's been planted in you, and that was planted by his dad. How fitting. So, like father, like son. But son took it to another level. And now they're going to put him away to another level. I'll holler at y'all later. Funny bone out.